Back up. hasn't stopped by yet. Huh? What? Makai hasn't stopped by yet. <clears throat> she said, you still by? Yeah. She hasn't stopped by yet. <laughs> when you say stop by, like just back up, all right? <laughs> Smack. Monkey bird, yeah. <laughs> Monkey bird, yeah. So on fourth down, the Redskins will call on Tressway to punt it away. And the kick's away as he angles this one for the sideline. No returning this one. It sails out of bounds, and they'll spot it right at the 20. So Prescott and the Cowboys now with a first and 10 at the 20. Now a handoff here to his running back. And he's going to get seven out of this before being taken down at the 27. Defense. And that one was relatively easy to see. I noticed that from up here. Yeah, it doesn't take a whole lot, does it? Sometimes you get multiples. What I always love on these offsides is when each side points at the other. Hey, you did it. No, you did it. They deciphered that one correctly. Here we go. North of Here 100 we go. yards, the two Here scores, and you know you got to give a lot of credit to the O line. We talked a lot about him, but offensive line was good too. They're obviously in sync with each other. Whether it's zone blocking, power running game, no matter what, he understands how to read them and find. He's got daylight. The 20, 10, touchdown, Cowboys. A great effort there with touchdown numbers. Here's Tressway now, as he'll kick it away for the second time. This is brought in at the 21. And shutting him off, now open field. A good return there, 17 yards. And the Cowboys will take over the football with a first and 10. Getting set to go again as we look at the back heading out of the field again. And you see his numbers from a week ago. He was up over 100 yards then, and he's already hit pay dirt here once in this one. We always talk about quarterbacks and receivers getting into rhythm, right? Really feeling good, finding each other downfield. I think running backs operate the same way. They can hit a good rhythm and a good stride, and he's carrying it over from last week. 23 yards on the pickup there and a first. Well, this is the reigning NFC Offensive Player of the Week. Runs like that might get him another award. Yeah, Thunderbolt right out of the gate, huh? How about that hitting the defense hard early? And, of course, carrying the momentum from last week into this week's game. The tackle made by Blake Martinez. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. And again this time to the tailback. And this time not quite to the 30. It'll be down at the 31-yard line. Getting the sense, Charles, are going to put a big emphasis this afternoon on the run game. And why not? What we're seeing so far, working pretty well from them. And here's the best part. We always talk about the best performers do their job when the lights come on. I think he likes natural light best. 
And they have the first down with that gain of four yards. Just about every coach we talk to says the crowd shouldn't affect us. That shouldn't be an issue. And then the next breath they talk about taking the crowd and taking them out of the game by picking up first downs and keeping them at bay. I think we just saw an example of that there, didn't we? Important to do, especially early in the game like they have. 17 yards on the play there, and the Cowboys have a first down. Here's Prescott. That's complete right around the eight. And here he'll get it down to the seven. That throw good for four. It's second down. After one, seven, nothing on EA Sports. Here's a quick throw out to Wilson. And he's brought down right at the five-yard line. Give him two on the play. The goal of a wide receiver screen is get enough blockers in front to create a wall and let him pick his spot to run the football. How about the defense there swarming to it and not allowing that to happen? Did not let him get downfield. Now they'll run it on the toss. And this winds up a pickup of two, maybe two and a half to about the 39. Well, we saw him there trying to get it to the outside, trying to get to the perimeter, but not a whole lot of room there. But there's got to be one positive to that. If you keep moving laterally, creases tend to develop as the game moves on, and they can run it back inside later. Some people call it a shuffle pass. Some people call it a shovel pass. All you're trying to do is open up the middle of the field, flip the ball forward. In this case, they didn't gain any yardage. Looking deep in the direction of Cooper. This is caught inside the 15. A big play here for the Cowboys. 55 yards. That's a heck of a way to convert on third and long, and he showed a lot of trust in his receiver. And that trust was justified because he went up and got the football and converted on it down. You shouldn't. Third and long like that, that's supposed to be an incompletion at the least. A real field flipper there as all of a sudden they've got a first down in the red zone. And he'll give it here to his running back. And he'll be brought down this time at the five-yard line. It's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. That play wasn't quite as big as the play that preceded it, but still, got to like the way they're moving the football partner. Absolutely. Pretty good room to run on that last play. Yeah, they didn't get a first down, but still, you'll take runs like that each and every time, won't you? The last run got six, now second and four. Now a handoff here to his running back. And the hole closes quickly here. He can fight only to about the four. Just a yard on the pickup there, and it'll leave him with a third and three. But when you go from second and four to third and three, that just tells you who won that battle on the last play, huh? Yeah, first round went to the offense, second round the defense. Now a handoff looking right. He needed three, he got two. Now that'll set up an interesting... Now they try the right side here. They'll be dropped after a gain of about six across the 30 to the 31. They'd love to just strike back with a touchdown right here, and if it's a long play, so be it. But the main goal, get a couple of first downs, run some plays, run some clock, allow their defense to get a chance to catch their breath, settle down, and relax a little bit after they just gave up the score. Gonna give this time to the tailback. Fighting through, and he's got space. And he'll be brought down. Oh, that's a face mask. Certainly looked like it indeed. Here come the flags. Defense. Officials so cognizant of that call nowadays, but that would look pretty easy. Yeah, you're right. They took out of their hands having to wonder whether it's a 5-yard or a 15-yard inadvertent or not. Now it's a lot easier. You see it, you call it. Boy, the run on first down, a disaster as he's tackled well behind the line. Keep playing hard, fellas. Oh, Here we go, 
56 the mic. 56 is the mic. On third down, it's Prescott. And a throw there going to be incomplete. Strong safety, Landon Collins, the one who got it. They'll start the third quarter here on the ground. Oh, and now he bowls him over. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. 11 yards and a Cowboy first down. And this is an example of breaking down a defense, because on a lot of these runs, he's getting past the point of attack. And guess what he's doing? Forcing the secondary guys to have to make a lot of tackles. Running game working. They'll stick with it on first down. Stop shy of the 45. Showed off a nice little move on the play, though. It's a seven-yard carry to set them up with a second and three. Throwing on second and three. Prescott. He's going to hit his man out of the backfield. Complete. Six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. On first and ten, Prescott. And he's going to find his man out of the backfield. That's complete. 11 yards and a Cowboy first down. In Washington territory now. Here's first and ten right at the 40. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop it. A good pick up there, 26 yards. Again, 26 yards. Mike 50. From the red zone now, Prescott. And this play gets blown up. They'll lose yardage back at the 17. The loss of a full three yards, and now it's second down. Looking to throw again on second down. Prescott. Didn't have a receiver open downfield as it turned out. Couldn't even find his outlet, man, because of the coverage. It's way too tight. Unable to find And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. A great play. Hey, that's the way you finish, boy. Finish it. Go ahead, Amy. Go. Mike 50, Mike 50. And he'll give it here to his running back. And just no chance of turning the corner. He can only get back to the line of scrimmage. Second and ten coming up. Prescott now from the 50. And he's got his man out of the backfield. That's complete. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. You know I'm going to lean towards the defender, right? You know I'm going to do that. I know. That's a tough situation for him as I see it. But the truth of the matter is, that ball was not streaking towards him. That little arc on it, he's got to find a way to get his head around and make a play on the football. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. Throwing again on second and ten. Prescott, and he can't hang on. That's definitely going to be one he wishes he had back. Incomplete in the end zone. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and ten. And he comes back with one complete. And they're going to stop him short of the first down as he's tackled at about the 21. Back now at FedEx Field. It's the Cowboys with a the football. They'll be looking to tack onto their lead as we get set for the fourth. And he'll be corralled right around the 34. It's a game of 12, and the Cowboys pick up the first. Do my eyes deceive me, or is he getting stronger as this game moves along? Burst seems just as good here in the fourth as it was way back in the first, doesn't it? I do believe someone put a lot of time in in the offseason and continues to condition during the season in order to continue to carry the ball at this rate. Now the Cowboys are going to burn the first of their timeouts. That'll leave them with two remaining. We'll be back after this. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. Now a handoff looking right. Shifts by him. So a nice job to break the one tackle, but not much daylight after that as he's brought down. In on the stop, Demonte Casey. Now they try the right side here. 
They follow up the first down one yard run with a minimal gain of two. Bottom line, they want to keep this clock rolling, so they'll take that one right there. They just want to keep falling forward, and they want to put the onus on the big fellas up front in order to bring this one home. And he'll be brought down with the first down and a late flag here, too. And he may get a few more tacked on for good measure. They're down here in the fourth, and that personal foul penalty is not going to help. No, in these types of situations, players will tell you that's extra intensity. From where we sit, it's actually frustration, not a good play. Maybe a critical mistake at this juncture is now they've got a first and ten. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. Now a handoff here to his running back. And he'll work it inside the 30 to the 29-yard line. A gain of five, good enough for the first down. Not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and 10. Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. So the Cowboys in possession of the football here as we get you reset. And the scoreboard on their side, they're just looking to melt away these final couple of minutes and put this one in the left-hand column. And this will leave them a yard short. Nice pickup of nine yards on first down. Another yard would probably put this thing in the books. It's second and one. Now they'll run it on the toss. And maybe a measure of revenge there. He's had his way in this one, but this time they get him behind the line. Now they'll run it on the toss. Dances by him. And now running right through him. Only a yard of the pickup there, and it's going to leave him. Now they'll run it on the toss. And he'll get him inside the 15 down to the 14-yard line. The safety landed Collins there to make the tackle. If nothing else, they've already taken a couple minutes off the clock here already as they come up second down. And that is caught, but he will come down out of bounds, says the side judge, incomplete. So after the second down incompletion, they'll come up now against a third and six. Oh, and now he and he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. 14 yards. And the Cowboys, they push out in front. So this one will end in a victory for the Dallas Cowboys. And it was their defense that really made the statement after the break. They pitched the second half shutout. Yeah, think about the team that just got vanquished. They did score in the second quarter. Do you think they thought at all that that would be their last points of the game? No, I, but what a second half. The adjustment, whatever they did in the locker room, it certainly worked. It certainly did, and you're exactly right. Whether it was an adjustment, whether it was just more focus on what they planned to do going in, whether they just played better, whatever it was, it all came together in the second half, and no points were allowed. That's a
you know what? time to the tailback. And he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. That's a good shot. That's a good shot. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. Now a handoff looking right. And give him six yards here as he stopped near the 35 at the 34. Here we go. 46. It's a gain of six, and it's third down. And he'll give it here to his running back. And he's going to have the first down at about the 38. And that's why he spent the first-round draft pick on a running back, not for just the fancy runs, but these dirty, gritty third and ones, third and twos. That's why you draft him. Pass on target, Prescott to Cooper. And he'll be brought down somewhat awkwardly here and a late face flag mask. as well. Defense. I think this one's going to be a face mask. So they'll take the yardage and tack on 15 go, more for the face go, mask. Go, Talk about a play that absolutely costs you in the end. Just trying to do your job, right? Trying to get him on the ground. Next thing you know, they'll march off another 15 against your squad. It'll be a pickup of 10 yards. And it'll be second and very short. Now it's a bootleg with Prescott. Wide open receiver complete. And this is going to lead to another first down as the tackle's made at the Bucs 12-yard line. The goal for any offense versus his own defense, find the holes where guys are available and put the ball on the receiver before any defender can step up and fill it. They did it well there. Perfectly executed crossing route. He juked him, and he'll take it into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. A great effort there. Hitting. Play fake. Here's Prescott. Got a man complete to Cedric Wilson. Boy, he ran free there after the catch as that winds up going for 38. I know we love our jobs, and pretty much any play we see, we're pretty, you know, excited about. But big plays, let's face it, that's what we absolutely look for. How about that one? That was great, and what our camera missed was the fist pump from the sideline after that catch. They're fired out. That's a big game. Now they try the right side here. And now running right through it. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. 14 yards, good for a Cowboy first down. Another good run there for a guy who, remember, on Wednesday was named NFC Offensive Player of the Week for what he did a week ago. Yeah, and you know it takes some solid runs and some extra special ones in order to win that type of an award. I think he's locked in and wants to get it done a second time. Nine yards is the pick up there, and they'll have a second and one. Now a handoff here to his running back. And he'll be brought down here at the three-yard line. The six yards on the pickup, and it leaves him with a first and goal. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he's going to get this back to the three-yard line and no further. They'll say no gain on the play, and it'll be second and goal. Second down and goal. Prescott. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. A great play there with his second touchdown here in this first half. As they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. CD, it seemed like they were so focused on the guys out wide, they forgot about him out of the backfield. That's a really good point because you've got to communicate, and oftentimes when you start counting receivers, that's exactly what you do. You start from the widest receiver, work your way inside, who gets lost sometimes? The back in the backfield. That's exactly what happened there. So on now is the Clemson man, Bradley Pinion, to punt this one away. And he was called on three times in the win last week as his first one here is away. 
Oh, and now he bowls him over. Another nice move. Now he goes spin. He takes a touchdown saving tackle to bring him down as he goes 32 yards on the return. First down, Prescott. Throwing right, and that's complete. And he gets it inside the 35 and just shy of the 30. 11 yards and a Cowboy first down. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. Prescott now. Quick hitter here, it's complete. Five yards on the catch there, brings up second down. Second and five after the five-yard completion on first down. They'll run it now out of the gun. And some room to run now. And they do get him down, but not before he's able to slip it inside the five-yard line. That good for 22 and a first down. Throwing Prescott. And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. A great effort there as the first half is... They'll start the third quarter here on the ground. And he will lose yardage and be backed up to the 24. That's going to go as a loss of a yard, and it'll be second down. A loss of a yard there to start out. That leads to a second and 11. And to give this time to the tailback. Takes it to the 26, just a one-yard gain. Prescott on first down. No gain on the dump off. It's second down. Well, that was a simple throw and catch, but even with that completion, zero yards gained, so they're behind schedule on down and distance. I think they were hoping to get it to him. He could make a man or two miss, but that window closed quickly. Back-to-back -back stops make it third and ten. Big play coming up. Here's third and ten. I would expect to see some pressure here. And now maybe they want some extra time to talk about this third and long play as we'll get a timeout. It's just their first, so two remaining as they burn one here in this third quarter. The pressure drops off as they look to throw. And this is going to lead to another first down as the tackle's made at the Bucks 28. And a good quarterback facing zone coverage. If he has just a little bit of time to survey the scene, that's what's going to happen. No doubt about it. If there's no pressure, he's going to continue to pick them apart because he'll have all that time to find someone open downfield. He can only cover for so long. So maybe they want to go to a zone blitz scheme, get a little bit more pressure. Remember when Carolina did that against Denver? They lost the game ultimately. They dropped the defensive end out, and he ended up with an interception in that game in Super Bowl 50. Maybe some sort of scheme like that to try and get more pressure at the passer. This throw right caught right around the six. And they are able to stop him, but he does take it all the way to the Let's two. Go, They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. For three red zone trips, three touchdowns so far. And this is caught for a Cowboy touchdown. Cedric Will. There we go. Oh. Here's Bradley Pinion now as he'll punt it away for the second time. This will be taken at the 10. 
Give him 11 yards that time on the return. Here we go. Here we go. And possession Here will switch. Hands first and 10. There again is the running back as he trots onto the field. He's had a touchdown for every quarter so far. Three here in the third and probably hoping he's not done yet. And this is a situation where it's okay to be greedy. When you've already scored three times, you want four, you want more than that. And guess what? That only helps your team. Yeah, so far three now in search of four. He's turning in a pretty impressive performance running the football and a big reason why they have this nice lead. And in days gone by, we would clip this out and put it up on the refrigerator, wouldn't we? Clip out the box score. Nowadays, not too many newspapers out there. Maybe you screenshot it online. And takes this one across the 35 to the 36, a gain of about four. And he'll give it here to his running back. And for one of the few times here today, this run's not going to go anywhere. No gain on the play there, so they're left with a third down and six. Here's Prescott looking for his running back, and he's got him. Accelerating, and off he goes. Touchdown, Cowboys. A big play there. 60. Now a handoff here to his running back. And very little running room there. He did get a couple up to the 49. Now a handoff working right. And he has met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. Two runs in a row, but only two yards to show for it. Prescott from the gun on third. He's going to find his running back. It's complete. It's a gain of 16 in the Dallas first down. Still throwing the football here, even with the big lead. Yeah, I know you and I came up in a different era, and we think about sportsmanship and all that. Other people think about fantasy points and getting their numbers. That's all they care about right now. Got to give this time to the tailback. And now running right through it. He'll get the first down and more inside the 20. And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. A great play there. 35 yards. And the Cowboy. Here we go, here we go. Mike, 45. You and he'll give it here to his running back. Just a yard on the pickup there, and it'll bring up a second and nine. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. Now a handoff here to his running back. And another mistake here defensively as a flag is down on the tackle, and that's going to tack on 15 more. So that flag will cost him 15. And it doesn't matter anymore how you get the face mask. Any part of it, that's going to be 15 yards. So he got free of one tackle, but couldn't do a whole lot else. Credit him with a one-yard gain there to make it second and nine. And to give this time to the tailback. Showed off the toughness, but still corralled shy of the five at the six. Call it an eight-yard gain. Much better shape now on third and just a yard. And he'll give it here to his running back. And he's able to pick up the first before he's brought down inside the five at the four. They only got two, but that was enough as they'll convert to make it first and goal. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he'll get in. Touchdown, Cowboys. Taking it in from four yards. A big offensive explosion helped leading them to victory. And the defensive guys, they're just saying, hey, put those points up every week. We'll just keep winning. They will gratefully accept them, won't they? It makes their job that much easier when they're scoring that many points. Allows them to play with a totally different style and a different flow. So for the Cowboys... The win means they'll finish the first half at a respectable 5-3 and three record. And they'll be able to enjoy this one through the bye week before they get back at it again. Meanwhile...